Let's continue, Captain Toad. If you're watching later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. How have you been enjoying so far? Uh, we're doing the bonus stuff now. It's the DLC, which I believe is just Mario Odyssey stuff. It might be very short, so. We shall see. Diaper adventure! The diaper adventure continues. Oh, this is just like marketing for Odyssey. Do the bait. Ready? <laughs> that worked. I think I'm supposed to assassinate all the Goombas. Let's just see if anything requires the rowing. What's with all the rotating squares? Rotating squares? What do you mean? The whole level, ah, uh, I don't know. Maybe it's just depth perception or something. Remember Link's, the remake of Link's Awakening had a similar effect on people. There was just something about the way that game did the graphics that gave certain people a headache. Could be in the same realm as that. The tilting? Oh, you mean me rotating the camera. It's definitely motion sickness. Yeah, I don't know. Oh. 
Like, do I need to get that? Hang on. That might be something. Ah, oh, never mind. Just replenishing vegetable. Wait, I saw a second underground part. Ah. Uh, oh, I can't go back. Oh, I saw, yes, I can. Yeah, what is that? I guess that's the end of it. Important to eat your veggies. I mean, <laughs> does Toad eat veggies? He just throws them. took a serious time. He's so small, there is not much room. Ah. Ah. It's a moon. Right, because that's what you collect in Odyssey. Oh. Course is a gold mushroom. Wait, there's no pixel toad. Well, that's lazy. All right. But I got the feeling it's... There seems to be like a lower area. stage. Shift in time.
many stages are there? One, two, three, four. No, there has to be more than that. I think all this DLC he is explaining is the moons that Captain Toad has in Odyssey. Wait, why is there no music? Oh, there we go. <laughs> that would be why. Well, this, this is doing the job of, like, making me want to play Odyssey. Promotion is a powerful thing. Or at least a few levels. Yeah, they'll go spend another $60. It's fine. There's no more coin. I got the feeling this is not going to be an hour long. Cool effect, which one? 320 coins. Did I get that? I don't think I did. Oh, the roller coaster? Yeah. I've done a few stages like that, but this one probably looks the best. Let's get better at aiming. This is an example of why, like, I'm pretty harsh with Pokemon games. I know that this isn't a Pokemon game, but, like, you know, the excuse that, oh, it's a Switch and it can't do nice-looking graphics, that's, that's not true. Look at this. And compare this to, like, the textures in Pokemon. They just don't look anywhere remotely on the same level as this. You'd like for her getting sick. Okay, that's fair. It's gotta be motion sickness. But this is a very nice looking game. And Pokemon can do much better. They can. Not a hardware issue. I need to restart because I didn't get enough coins. I mean, okay, it's standing still. Look at the grass, for example. Then go look at a screenshot of the grass in Pokemon. That's <laughs> just... Oh, man. Alright, anyway. Yeah, 
I mean, I think it's the only fran Nintendo franchise that just isn't up to the same visual quality. just want to play Odyssey now. To see the difference? No, just to play Odyssey. <laughs> this isn't for comparison or making a point, I just want to play Odyssey. I didn't stream it because it came out in the year where I, uh, I moved houses and then didn't have internet for six months, so it released in that window. didn't have other stuff planned. <laughs> have to find it as well. It's in a box somewhere. Plans can be changed, I suppose. more just like, do I, do I really feel like subjecting myself to a platformer? No comment on the game, it's more just... The state of mind I have to be to play a platformer. Do I, do I want to be making weird noises today? I don't know. Oops. Is this going to be just don't take damage? Oh, they don't break stuff. I didn't know it was a conscious decision. Well, it's a conscious decision if I know that the game itself is going to make me do that, which it will. It happens naturally. It's like, alright, if I play, for example... I mean, even this one, it doesn't, it doesn't happen. Not that often. There are games I can play where I don't make a sound. I think so. I mean, okay, when I play Starter, it's like I can go, I'd say, 95% of playing that game without making a sound. It's just when really annoying things happen that, understandably, I have to express myself.
or like Terraria. I can play that game without making a noise if I'm just building. It's it's not it's not that I don't want it's just I I don't want to hurt my voice, that's all. Look, my throat is a little scratchy. And if I'm making noises, it just means tomorrow I'm probably not gonna wake up that well. Like, even this game, I was like, ooh, I gotta resist the temptation to make the toad sounds. <laughs> what am I saving it for? Uh, being functional? <laughs> like, just being able to exist? I kind of have to use my voice to, I don't know, do work, uh, exist. Oh, ho, oh, ho, oh, boy. Okay, jeez, that was a save. I messed up. cease to exist if I can't use my voice. Well, may as well be. Goal is to take out all the piranha plants. Or creepers, whatever they're called. Ah, oh, what? Thought I landed on it. I'll have to repeat myself. I'm screwed. No, I'm fine. How does that keep happening? How would I... I'm not sure how this one would get attacked. Maybe I'm completely wrong. Oh, no, maybe it can. Yeah, it goes all the way to the end. This is a very long level. I think there was a little collateral damage there. I think the other one hit the main one.
What? I'm gonna close that before any accidents happen. This thing needs. This thing has to go. <laughs> Stop. Let's just bring back these childhood memories where these things would just be my demise in every Mario game. There we go, now I can relax. No threat here. Okay, I see what I need to do now. was the gold mushroom. This would make a nice thumbnail. Just need to rotate the camera and then there we go. <laughs> no, no effort. Make a funny face. That's everything. Alright, so how do I... The only thing missing is just to break into the park. What have I forgotten about? It looks like I need the pickaxe. But I didn't see one up there. Oh wait, no I don't. I'm overcomplicating it. There we go. There's my pickaxe. Do I go more coins? Wait, is this Bambi Street? No, Ramby Street. Ramble Ramby and Ratley. Nice. 
Oh, it's a boss? I think this is the nicest looking kingdom in in uh, Odyssey. Look at this. I mean, the colors are so bright. This is going to be survival for the toads, isn't it? Oh my lord. No, I lost two. Let's start again. Oh no, I should definitely start again. This is going to be where I have to survive with at least a couple. Keep three alive. I'm just gonna do the level and focus on the other stuff later. Th what is this camera angle? Dude, <laughs> how am I gonna survive? Oh, that's it. I don't get to fight it. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna be here a while. Survive with all four. <laughs> it's not gonna work. Hey, Cole, and how's it going? Okay, okay. Alright, line them up, line them up, line them up. <laughs> I have to survive with four. Oh no, this is so annoying. Okay, I got a... I got another gem. Alright. Very tired, almost Friday, I bet. It's, it's like, what, five in the morning? I'd be non-functional at that hour. That right, day was alright, not too long today. Oh uh, yeah, I guess all, all I did yesterday was just do some video editing and then I saw movie. I saw No Hard Feelings. She was alright. Oh. 
what was that about? Uh, it's a comedy movie. It's Jennifer Lawrence in it. So she just plays someone that's in debt and her car gets taken away from her. So it ruins her livelihood to pay her bills and she's going to lose her house. And uh, she sees an ad from a rich family that wants someone to help get their son out of his shell before he goes to college. So, you know. Comedy. Okay, I got the gem, so now I can focus on the four thing. It's not the greatest movie, but it's it got some laughs. That's the important thing. It's not the richest plot. <laughs> Now to just win with four. Can I stop this thing with... Like if that... That's something I can do. Because I haven't tried. Oh, this seems to be more of a liability than help. Nope, nothing helps. Pretty much a case of get good. Ah! <laughs> I think this is a, this is the strategy right here. You got to keep them in a straight line together. Otherwise, it's just too hard to avoid. One fell behind. <laughs> How did one fall behind? I love how just like a few minutes ago I was saying, oh, I don't want to play anything that makes me make noises or do funny voices because my throat is like a little scratchy. See, and potato chips with salt. What is potato? I thought salt would make things worse. See, I understand. Salt helps the throat. Hmm. Well, I don't have just plain salt. I have just chili with. <laughs> Well, that does have salt in it, not the right kind of salt, I'm sure. Third brigade. Oh, it's the brigade stage. Here you go. Yeah. You gargle the salt water, no? Yeah, I just didn't think consuming it would help. I thought the fried nature of the potatoes would uh, not help. Gargling salt with water—that's a different thing.
Oh, this stage is different. It's not collecting gems at all. possible to take everything out. Let's see. Oh, I can't... Apparently I can't walk through this. Yeah, I mean, I think... I, I definitely believe the, the salt aspect of it. It's more the potato chip aspect, because I thought fried foods, like, don't do... <laughs> Aren't a good thing to have when you're sick. Reminds me of what's the name of the game? It's an NES game, but it involved moving things up and down. Like this. I can't remember the name of it. Toads, please. This is going to bother me now. What was the name of the game? <laughs> Have I had kiwis of like the fruit or the New Zealanders? The fruit, okay. But you're asking like, oh, like any any people from New Zealand pop into chat. I can't say I've eaten one for a very long time. Have I? Uh not to my knowledge. Definitely have friends from New Zealand. I mean, again, it's like, you know, the audience from Australia, and I would imagine New Zealand is very limited around here. Oh, so this is different now. Here you go. Would I shave it? Okay, see, that's just... I'm not going to explain the context of that quote at all. I know what you're referring to, it's like the BRB message. And I think that's just better as is. And just those who those who were there, no, they know. You just got to that part of Majora's Mask. Jeez, it was that long ago, huh? like I was going to remember. <laughs> it just thought it was a genuine question, like, hmm? Oh, like maybe there's a home remedy for Kiwi, I don't know. 
I have to take everything at face value. That's annoying. It's not, it's not the worst thing that's been said around here. You waited two days to ask, so that's commitment. There's been just so many, so many things that I, I, I'm just waiting for the day that people go watch those VODs and then it starts becoming a thing again. need to watch something <laughs> not live. Fair, I mean, fair enough. I'm not saying don't watch it. It's more just, oh boy. Just some of the conversations I've had over the years. Squad. Oh, I have to line them up perfectly. Where's the last one? I would imagine the last one is, is in the pit. When did I stop playing Zelda from once a week to every day? Ah, uh, don't again. Like, asking me questions about 2020 to 2021 and 2022. It's just like I I don't know. I can't. It would have had to have been when the second trailer of Tears of the Kingdom dropped when the release date was more known, and then I was like, okay, well... Uh, realistically, I need to get a move on, I think. The decision definitely came from knowing exactly when the game was releasing versus, like, a vague 2022 and then eventually 2023, because it got delayed. I almost died. If, if I was to take a guess as to which game it would have been, it would have been... Mm, Twilight? I think Twilight was definitely the first one where... Like, I sat down for a whole weekend and played it properly and then still did more of it through the week. Where on earth is... where? Where's this last toad? Over there, I'm so blind. 
I missed it. I did take a large break from it, like... Um... I played Oracle of Seasons, then took a break for a long time, and then came back and played Oracle of Ages. Because... I wanted... to use the new thing that I got. And the quality was gonna be better. Because Oracle of Seasons and Link's Awakening I played on the, the GameCube, using the GBA player. And whilst that did the job, but... One, didn't look the greatest, but two, also the GameCube controller has a terrible D-pad. So, yeah, like, I waited a few months and got the thing I have now. Which does that nice quality and I can use that Super Nintendo controller. It was definitely worth the wait. Being safe. I'm not even sure what the objective is going to be. This was after Majora's. Uh, I think it was Oracle of Season and Ages. It goes Majora's, Oracle of Season, and Ages, Wind Waker, Minish Cap, Twilight Princess, Phantom Hourglass, Spirit Track, Skyward Sword, Link Between Worlds, Force Sword, no, Triforce Hero, sorry, Breath of the Wild, then Tears of the Kingdom. So Wind Waker is after the Oracle games. 150 coins, huh? Oh boy, Wind Waker. And between that I played the, uh, the enhanced version of Zelda 2. Which is like a, a bonus, I guess. There's also it's the original, there's like stuff that's before I did all the stuff, like the first time I played Skyward Sword. Because the one that was the most recent, that was the second time playing in hero mode. But there was the first time I played it, like the original, when it first uh, came out on the Switch. I definitely struggled <laughs> with some of the fights in that. Is Twilight on the Switch? No, it's on the Wii U. Still surprised they haven't released it for the Switch. I don't think they will. At this point's probably too late. I said it when I was playing Twilight and, you know, people were hoping and asking, they were like, do, you, do I think Twilight is gonna come out on the Switch? I hope it does, but I don't think it will. And the reasoning is, if you look at the re-release of Skyward Sword, for example, when they re-released it, they added a bunch of new things. 
to justify the big price tag. Alright. But the problem with Twilight Princess and Wind Waker is they've already released them on the Wii U. And any time they bring a game from the Wii U over to the Switch, they always add something new, something new. So it's like, what could they add to those games that would be new? When those games already added new things, like... There's probably not a whole lot they could do outside of just porting it over, and so... People want those games on the Switch, but they don't want to pay the full price. Like, in their minds, they're like, Yeah, Nintendo will put out uh, Twilight Princess. They'll just take the Wii U version and put it on the Switch, and then we'll get charged $40 for it. Or even $30. But in Nintendo's mind, they're like, Okay, how can we charge $60 for this? And I think that's the problem, is I, I don't think they see a scenario where they could realistically charge 60 for it without people getting upset. That's why I think it hasn't been released yet. Not so much that they can't, it's just... I don't know if they will. I mean, then again, Metroid did, you know, get surprisingly remastered and released for a pretty reasonable price tag, so who knows, but... Nintendo's just weird. <laughs> just, they're never consistent in anything. Who knows what they're thinking is sometimes. Especially since a lot of people like that one. Yeah, I mean, Twilight and Wind Waker, they're definitely up there. That's why I, I, I was sort of waiting for it as well, because there were rumours that it was going to happen, but it just never, never did. I need more coins. Does it show the objective? I don't think it does. Majora's Master Time skip song on the 64. I only skip from the dawn and dusk, and you're able to pick the time you want to skip to. The shock you had to skip and wait for that time. Oh. I mean, maybe I didn't know how to do it, but. It is a bit weird that they changed some something to be worse. I don't know. I did it right? Okay. I mean, that's why I play those versions of those games, was just... They... They were definitive. I mean, if you look at Ocarina of Time 3D and just the Water Temple, oh man, is that... That, that section's so much better. But I mean, even in Majora's, they had the same thing going on later. sad they cut the end scene. I mean, maybe I needed to do something specific to get it. Maybe it wasn't cut. Maybe I missed out on something. I just think the funniest thing to me in that game was just the Zora quest. That not only did the Zora character die, but also just the talking tombstone. <laughs> I was not expecting that.
Alright, I, I don't see any more coins, so... Oh, wait. No! Oh, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot! I, the fun, the funny thing is I realized where the coins were. I realized too late. There's a golden mushroom on top of that thing specifically. I do like Majora's in some ways more, but I mean, Ocarina is the better game, it's just I feel like the world in Majora's I like a lot more. both could just hate at the three day time limit. Yeah, I think they should have been a little less strict with just what decided to get deleted. I mean, there were a couple times where I just did not finish the temple in time, just... Progress being undone. The thing. And I, I, I get why, but like, some of that wasn't necessarily progress, it's like knowledge. It's, okay, I've been in this temple before. Why should the map get erased? Like, it's stuff like that where there are other things which they chose to just leave. Like, okay, there are certain things that are just magical and persist through time, but we're gonna be really oddly specific about the map for some reason. I think it would have gone a long way to just. Oh, that's fucking annoying. It wasn't the... I need to finish the stage. Yeah, like bottles and weapons, exactly. <laughs> but you can't have arrows, yeah. I mean, they... It did make it pretty easy to collect ammo, but it was still just one of those things that adds up in the end. I do like the idea of it, though. My experience with that game was a bit weird because I, I didn't play it to begin with, but then I played games inspired by it. So I sort of knew what, what to expect from it. I messed up. had the same problem you did as a kid with the coffee quest. Remind me, what did I do or not do? Just not finding them? Or just being horrendous at it? The 
the coffee quest was like the really long one, wasn't it? not figure that one out see if parents got you the book just knowing the timing could be at a certain spot yeah there's no way i would have organically figured that one out so I, I definitely had to look that one up that was the other problem with it it's just a lot of the figuring out what to do and where to be it just reminded me of zelda one in a good way and both a bad way it's like funny i'm gonna i'm gonna i've been trying to do scripted videos for youtube and like i'm pretty much done with one as long as it's taken <laughs> over complicated a little but I'll, i'm gonna do one where like i'm gonna do the tier my tier list for the zelda games and just kind of go over my experiences with with each of those games whilst it's still fresh in memory i've written most of it out But, it's just, yeah, Zelda 1, I, lo I love that game, but I, I can acknowledge that the things were, there's two, there's two ways to progress in, in that game. It's either, you know, there's a spot, and you look at that spot, and it's like, oh, yeah, no, there has to be something there. That looks so suspicious, that's a secret, and it's intuitive. Or, you progress because... You literally try everything, and then you discover it by accident. And I feel like Majora's Mask has a lot of that going on when it comes to the... ...being there at the right place at the right time... ...for those particular quests. It's just... ...you wouldn't be able to figure it out. At least not as a kid. Maybe... ...a lot of them do have the correct text, but it's just one of those things that... ...I don't think you can piece together easily. So it shares a lot of similarities with Zelda 1 in that regard. That's why it's, it's like, I I like the world in Majora's a lot. Um, I think the world is a lot more crafted in terms of how it looks. Like visually it looks, I think it looks better in some places than Ocarina did. But in terms of just the aspect of like figuring out where to go in the quests, uh, it's a bit rough. It, it could have been a lot better. They should have been more lenient as to what decides to stick around when, uh, you know, you have to fast forward time or rewind. It said 120 coins, right? Like, I'm not imagining it. But I think I can only get to one... 117. And then hurrying up and trying to figure out where you go. Yeah, exactly. The problem gets worse when there's like a time limit placed on everything. And then you have to like make the tough choice of should I go for this or should I go reset my day? I still really did enjoy the game overall. It's 150 coins. No, it has to be find the gold mushroom. Where's the gold mushroom? Alright, I'm gonna look for the gold mushroom without rescuing the toads. I feel like I'm going crazy. Like, I know where the mushroom is, but... I thought it was on that block there, unless the stage has changed. Probably something obvious I missed. Hmm. 
distraction. Nah. I think it's that at all. I think genuinely, like, uh, either they've moved it or I've forgotten. Oh, I think I know where it is. They've moved it. I think I know where it is. Not here. Then where is it? I thought it, I thought for sure it'd be hidden here. Bet I can make him dizzy. <laughs> I didn't know that. This is 100% on getting the gold mushroom. There's no other way to do it. So where is it? So I can only squeeze out two more coins out of this. In the normal stage, the gold mushroom is on top of this thing. But it's not here this time. What now? <laughs> I left the toads there. Alright, now I'm gonna go around as just regular toad. driving crazy where I sit. There's no, there's no other way to do this. Where is this mushroom? If I fall down that hole, I'm dead, right? I can go into that pit, but that's most likely death. Get it? Where is it? I'm losing my mind. Where is it? Well, 
Well, you don't see it, like, you walk up to it. Well, okay, sometimes you do see it, but most times it's this invisible thing that once you get near it, you'll see, like, a, a vegetable root, and then you just pull it up. But I have looked basically everywhere. Oh, you asshole. <laughs> God damn it. Alright. Stuck in the, the tiniest of corners. They moved it from where it was. Alright. Oh, no! Oh! Okay. Breathe. Just, that was in my ear the whole time. Oh. <sighs> Tired Brigade to Bullet Bill Base. Alright. Well, at least these stages are interesting. I mean, it's recycled content a little bit, but I think it's fine. Try and take out the bird. There we go. Now it's out of the way. I wish this icon didn't take up the whole screen. I think that's enough. Alright. Jeez. Ooh, no, this might be bad. The problem is they all have to... St Ugh. They all have to stand there. I feel like the lack. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Damn it. Alright, I need to take out the brick. Otherwise, yeah. We all don't fit on. I should have seen that coming. I mean, I kind of did, but I just didn't think it would be a big deal.
estaré I mean, eventually it'll hit. It just makes that pot easier. I don't have to deal with the owls. There we go. Oh wait, I need to shoot twice. Here I was worried that these stages wouldn't last more than an hour. Is this the last one? No. Okay. That should be much safer now. Oh boy. Oh. I probably should have waited. It's fine. It's fine. I'm gonna wait. Toads, please. Assemble. The objective be coins? I suppose it could be. Oh, no. <laughs> it's about the metal one. This is me being safe, y'all. Because now I can freely explore the rest of this. I miss coins. There we go. That's a hundred. If it's likely to be anything, it's going to be a hundred. It'll be sad if it's like 120 or something. No! <laughs> Why are they yelling, hey, I'm here? Oh. Yep. Imagine I don't go back for those coins. <laughs> How annoyed I would be right now. Okay, camera keep. It looks like interesting. We'll see what this is. Here you go. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Why am I doing the voice? 
I, I, I need to stop. I hurt my voice. I need to make tea. I'm amazed at just how that noise leaves leaves my mouth, honestly. I need a second player. I'm getting all the coins. I need someone to just spam attack Kamek over and over again. I put the coins there, but I guess that's where the toad was. Makes sense. Well, I think Australia started playing. <laughs> I can hear people. <laughs> well, neighbours. <laughs> playing against England today, so. I just want to know if I get a day off. That's. Yeah, if they win, then there's going to be talk of the public holiday. Because that's it, they reach the finals if they win today. Jealous. Well, just gotta. Americans have gotta get better and just be able to reach the finals as well. get a day for offer it really you don't think that if America won like the soccer world cup you'd get a day off for it not even for say the final match I mean the thing is it's not like everyone stops working it's just a public holiday and public holiday rules comes into play you might still work It's just, I guess, because mine's like an, an office job, effectively. And then that's why it's like, oh, office is closed. Not that I go to an office anymore, but, you know. But I guess what, they'll just... There wouldn't be a big deal. Six days a year. Man. Well, when you put it that way. It would feel like I'd, I'd be getting constant public holidays by comparison.
Well, that's just annoying. The next day off is in September. What's the actual holiday? Let's compare. Mine's for a sports game. <laughs> And then the one after is for a horse race. I don't know if you can get more serious than that. I mean, when I say it like that, it's like, yes, that that, that is what it's for, technically. <laughs> but the reasoning is... The sport was invented in the state that I live in, and the horse race is like... It has some historical significance and cultural significance for the early days of uh, the state that I live in. So that's why. Labor Day? Ah. The social and economic achievement of American workers. Psst. Where are the uh, social and economic achievements of the sports? Fuck yeah, sports! What, sports contribute to the economy? What do you mean? They work hard. Ugh. I'm going to try and do as much of the stage as possible. So that I'm not relying on... ...having to... ...defend the toads. Like, I'm almost positive the two Kamex at the top can just, uh, get destroyed eventually. But we'll see. Wish you got the day off of the Super Bowl. Well, I think it should be something. If you base it off the Australian equivalent, it's whoever invented, or I guess maybe not invented, but you know, brought the sport, whether invented or brought the sport over to America and did it first, that should be the state that gets it. That's how it works here. It's not like it's a nationwide thing that everyone gets a day off for the uh, the grand final. That's not how it happens. That's Jersey. Well, they would get the public holiday. For contributing something so iconic to the people, you know? want to dispose of these things because it's just too much of a nightmare to make sure none of them get shot. It really is. Wait a minute, there was Toad... Huh. Is the other one gonna magically appear? No. Okay, no more harassment. Yeah, this is the way to do this stage. Nice. Peace and quiet.
I would just love to see a game that has, like, a scene that has at least a thousand toads just all making toad noises all at once. Like, you know, the battle scene in, in Lord of the Rings, The Two Towers, just imagine it's like Toads versus the Coopers. And, you know, one Captain Toad is leading the army and just, uh, just leads the battle and the charge, and then suddenly just this cacophony of fucking Toad voices. One thousand Toads. At least. They all have to sound the same as well. I don't want any variety. All my toads sound the same. I feel like that was a missed comedic opportunity in the Mario movie, was just making all the toads sound the same. I mean, by all means, give them a, a voice actor like they did, but just make him voice every toad with the same voice. Two hundred and forty coins. Here you go. How many did I have? Hold on. Do I? I don't. I don't think I want the answer to that question. But let's just see. I missed out. Okay, it's the gold mushroom again. All right. Here you go. Yeah. Same as same as last time. Go take out the Kamek at top and then do the rest of the stage. I'm gonna go do that right away, because it's just otherwise too much of a pain. Probably hit it with the key, but... Uh. Two hundred and forty coins, alright. Let me just squeeze the one coin out of Kamek. Have I already got it? I may already have it. Alright. Oh wait, I gotta fall down. Is gold shroom. Whoops. Oh, 
<laughs> no, the other one fell further. Whoops. Oh well. There we go. See, it's fine. For what they lack in strength, they more than make up in terms of squishiness to be able to to survive a a fall that would otherwise shatter a normal human's bones. Being soft and squishy has its advantages. Three yet? No, I don't think it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just standing in the fire, no big deal. Just, I just need that shroom, that's it. This is just, I have to search every corner, don't I? Much like the other one, it's just gonna be in some obscure corner. We just listen to the constant. <laughs> just... Okay, never mind. I, I did it. Mummy me on flip panel footpath. All right, what is this? I'm gonna get chased, aren't I? Yep, I'm getting chased. I mean, with this, I feel like it's not a big threat as long as I stay ahead of it. Oh yeah, that's fair. Float. Float, do it. Float some more. Oh, 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 luck. Holy shit. I'm not sure how I just did that. This 
thing needs to hurry up. Oh wow, this thing's catching up quickly. Why am I doing this? <laughs> I swear if it's not a coin thing, I'm gonna be annoyed. 160! <laughs> Even then, it still wasn't enough. <sighs> what? Okay, I'm doing this in advance. as many as I can to make my job easier, right? I feel like this isn't zoomed in enough. Oh, there's coins in the middle. How do I get those? There's no ladder. Alright, sorry about this. I'm going to run around the <laughs> circle here a little bit. This is probably the safest I can be. Good. Uh, yeah. I have the right idea. Do you get pearls from the pearl oyster? It's an animal crossing. I know there's a way to get pearls, I just don't think it's the oyster. Pearls are definitely a thing, in it? Just for the life of me, I can't remember how. I know it's not an, a critter that gives you it, it's like just a reward from an event. You would think it was from the oyster. I dropped down too soon, that was my problem. Wasn't ready yet.
Run around in a circle. So let us safe again. extra distance you have to travel. <laughs> Thankfully it gives you a little bit of wiggle room. Alright, there we go. It doesn't look like there's too many of these kind of levels. Oh no. Okay, well that's... I feel like I should almost start again. Oh well, now, uh, yeah, now. Oh wow, I'm making some very dangerous moves here. The thing is not to panic, it's just it moves as quick as you do. Fuck. I stuck around too long. Just keep... A relative distance. stepped on it. Okay. It, it, oh crap, it's already on me. I thought it didn't start until a while. It doesn't reach. Alright, go. Good. Oh, 
Oh, shit. Oh, ho, 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 ho. No! <laughs> shit. Almost had it. This is a stressful level. Not screwed myself on that one. Regretted it immediately. It really does. Look too fast! Jeez. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. I swear, I saw the coin count if I miss out by one coin. Okay, good. <laughs> I was worried it's gonna be 200. Oh no, there's more. Now it's the boss stage. So now I have to do it with this as well. <laughs> screwed it up. So I had to collect coins in this as well. That's, uh, yeah. Seems fair. Okay, should I just take the first hit? Oh, ho, Okay. <laughs> isn't too bad. the control. <laughs> Dick. I don't think you can stay on this ladder. I'm gonna die. Oh no, wait, it does count. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. That's interesting. I could probably still do it. Alright, 
Alright, not anymore. Restart. I guess I should see how many coins it wants me to get. I'm making the assumption it makes a high amount of coins to do this. Not good. I didn't want to climb the ladder, but okay. Drop. I don't think I can do that. That seems too difficult, but let's... I'm just going to progress. I'm going to pretend that's not there. Get that at the very least. I feel like that one's necessary. That's, that's just not fair. <laughs> it just blocked me. That wasn't fair. I, I, I had no choice. I was trying to do but cool thanks i love how it just interpreted that as oh yeah climb the ladder i was trying to turn around and then it just snapped to the ladder We might be here a while. <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna get to the end of the stage. I need to, I need to know how many coins I'm getting. I'm just making this large assumption like, oh, I have to get practically every coin to succeed. Imagine if I just have to get like 20 or something. Well, it's just more, it's not a, a question of whether or not 
people are getting bored of so I question of my own sanity, like, just trying the same thing over and over again. And that I'm not even 100% positive like I have to do this. Here, I, I definitely have to slow down. Oh, uh, what? What is that? Again? Yeah, nice. Good. Good. I swear if it's 150 coins. I have 147. Oh, no. Okay, leave. <laughs> I was going to look for coins, but nope. Oh no. <laughs> I have to get those ones. No, I was like, oh no, they probably wouldn't be so cruel to make me get those. Oh no, I have to get those. Alright, well, now I know what I'm up against. Well, sometimes it's it's simple. Sometimes it's not the complicated thing, and then other times it's just... Go fuck yourself. Go d do it. Achieve the goal. You want 100% the game? Go on. Do it. Grab the ladder! Ho ho ho! The player wants to grab the ladder, so we make the character automatically grab the ladder to be smart. It's a way of ensuring the player has a smooth experience. Honestly, a Christmas miracle I got through that one without getting hit. I think, I think this is good. Oh, this part, this part just sucks. I'm on 167, I... I I have to survive the mushroom. <laughs> Missed out by three. So you have to not take a hit to get the 10 from the red mushroom. Oh, no, I'm on 170 now. All right. I guess you get three for getting the dragon. Good. Memories of our adventures now. Prologue. Oh. 
This is just the start of the game, though. I think I'm done. <laughs> that. Feathers, this time. Not a bird. No, just kidding. How many times are, is this going to happen for them before they learn? <laughs> There's a gold mushroom in this stage. For adventure. Okay, well now that I know this, that means each stage has a gold mushroom. Okay. Alright, so don't leave the stage without finding the mushroom. There it is. Doesn't let me skip it. <laughs> we have to watch it. Now I know what I'm looking for. Mm. Alright, find the gold mushroom. Wait, it's just this thing again. <laughs> Why should these count as levels? So you can see the mushroom symbol this time. Ah, it's not there this time. It's subverting expectations. Keep the player on their toes. gonna be on top of that thing. It's just a matter of can I drop on top of it. I'm not touching that thing until I find the mushroom. So. Yay. Like, this is less about finding the star and more about the shroom.
Alright. Uh Ready for adventure! Oh, this is like prologue? Oh right, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's not this. I mean, this is really nice looking, but... It's like, hmm. Three times they fall for it. Congratulations! There's a new page in bonus. Keep on. Oh, this is just a bonus game. I think. Let's see. This is a little stressful. Why is it catching up to me so quickly? Say, collect five thousand coins. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! All right, I guess it's time to get good, huh? Five thousand coins, huh? Dude, why does it catch up so quickly? The diaper will most certainly be required after this one. Toad's diaper adventure. Okay, okay. So far, so good. Thank you. 
Why? That's speed up. Jeez. play so well. 2,000, huh? 2,000, huh? Oh, Jesus, this was a bad call. Out, out, out. music. Really not helping. Ah, crap, I hit a wall. Really not helping my situation here. Two thousand is a lot. Especially when I can only take two hits. Also, the music seems to be getting quicker to stress me out. So there's that. I mean, almost halfway. Alright. Gamer face on. I'm getting this. I sat up in my chair. Shit, serious now. I mean, there's gonna be multiple mummies chasing me. I have already resigned to that fact. Like, it's gonna happen.
I love how this has just become an arcade game now. But this is replay value. Ooh, I almost ate shit on that one. This is like a song where the beat just, well, the main song just never starts. <laughs> okay. All coins must must be acquired if I'm going to have any chance of doing this. I said game of faces on. <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. Alright, well there's there's the spicy nature. I was like, oh how's how are they gonna make this harder? Not with multiple ghosts, no. Holy shit. <laughs> Dude, the dodging. Let's mess that up. Well, that didn't really buy me much. I guess just a wide enough area. Really there. Oh, 
less than 500 to go. Oh, this is the dead end. It's okay. Got a bonus coin. Expecting the difficulty to just really crank up. Three hundred to go. The lives have stopped mattering at this point. So close. All right, it's gonna happen on floor ten. That's it. I got it. Let's just see. There's nothing else. A little break before it, I'm sure, gets harder. Okay. Ooh, the music's different. And there's two now! Oh, wow. Jeez. Okay. Difficulty curve. <laughs> Okay, now the game has begun. <laughs> I still got it. Oh, it's 5,000! Wasn't it 2,000? Is it 5,000? Was it 5,000 the whole time? That's a fucking big ask. Yeah, I thought it was 2,000 as well. Am I losing it? Or is this something where the goalposts just keep shifting? Hmm. Hmm. Just a sec. I thought it was 2,000. <sighs> Unless I said 2,000 and it never was 2,000 to begin with. I mean, what? That was like 15 minutes, if not longer? Uh, I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I want to do this. It seems like a lot. Why would I say 2,000? I don't know. Tired? Misread? Like, idiot? <laughs> Those are all very potential reasons for me reading 2,000. 
I suppose there's one way to find out, like the footage. The footage doesn't lie. I'm already into this attempt, but I think whatever this attempt is, it'll be the last one. I just don't think I feel like throwing my head against this one. Jeez, that was close. Especially since there's no recovery mechanic. If you take a hit, that's, that's it. It's like very detrimental. If there was some way for me to recover health, yeah. Oh wait, no, there is on floor 10. Okay, but like still. There was a mushroom on the 10th floor. I do remember that. See, that's very far apart. Wait, I can take out the ghost? Yeah, temporary, okay. Temporary ghost relief. Just have to put myself in the zone like I did before. Whatever it is I did before, it worked. Can't be as greedy once it gets past floor 10, clearly. Okay, this is the football floor. Jeez. close. But I have to be this greedy. I don't think it's too bad to get past 10. It's just, it takes a while. I would rather a goal of, say, a thousand, but then 
you know, the coins happen less often. And you just have to do a better job at surviving. Ooh, there is a mushroom just randomly here. Maybe random is just random. Yeah, I'm not gonna be picking for three coins. Some of these maneuvers I'm doing, there's no way I can do them when there's two chasing me. I have to run further to come back. Shit. Oof, this is a little scary. Oh! Oh, almost died. Almost ate it on that wall. Ten. I wonder if there's any difference if I do it manually or like... I don't think there is. Just take this with me. Yeah, the fact that it's Goombas now, that makes this so much harder. You really have to think ahead now. Cross the streams, no crossing the streams. Okay, well, this is definitely a new record now. Shit. Spoke, may have spoken a little too soon. May have just jinxed it. Oh, 
I mean, based on this, 5,000 is, is an insane amount to have to go get. I'm not, sh I'm not sure if progression is the answer to my problems here. I feel like the quicker I progress, the worse this is going to get. the Goombas. Okay, next. So I'm gonna get the lay of the land before I go too far in. Taking the ballsy risk. Oh, I may have screwed myself here. Okay, don't panic. Alright, I'm fine. Oh, not this again. Get rid of the guys. Okay, I've opened the whole map up. Let's play well. Should be able to get this whole floor. Imagine that AI was like more like the guys from Pac-Man, where they were all individual. <laughs> Instead of this simple, well, just following your footsteps. Oh no, it's ghosts. Speaking of ghosts... Yeah, this is not the floor for me. Oh my god. I can't, I can't risk this. Go. Too many chasing. Fuck. Dead end. No. Ah! Five thousand is, is an insane amount. Like I, I could do this for hours and not get near it. <laughs> All right, one last attempt. That's it. Absolute final one. Absolute final one. This is it. I'm gonna make this one count. That'll round it up to like three hours for this vod. Here I was worried it would only be like one. Yeah, in in some ways this is like just a weird Pac-Man.
ghost part is, is where it ramps up. Like, I thought the Goombas were bad. Oh no, the ghosts, straight up, if you take a wrong turn, you're screwed. Hey, Lucasen, how's it going? Got me in the middle of uh, like this mini game. I probably should have gone to the next floor, but it's fine. I'll use these early floors to get as many coins as I can. And it's still not chaotic yet. I believe they added this to be able to 100% the game. Okay, I think that's all the coins for this floor. Room. Oh no, it's this floor. Okay, quickly. I'm just gonna open it up. Alright, there. I should be able to get anywhere. I've been pretty lucky with the pickaxes so far. Gotta be more careful taking corners, that keeps happening. Okay. Never wanted to beat a minigame so badly. <laughs> huh? I think once I get to the Goomba floor, that's where I'll not try to get every coin. It just gets too hard. Oh. oh. 
corners. This could easily be its own game. They could expand upon it and just make it a cheap or even free game on Switch Online. I'd play it. <laughs> just It just feels like a really weird Pac-Man and I kind of like it. the exit. Over there. Gotta turn around. lot better at dodging. Wait, how do I get over there? Ooh. Get a little break at ten. Ugh, all right, I can relax for a minute. So, by the looks of it, I have to get to roughly twenty five to get like the, uh, the seal of approval thing. Starts now. The only floor I'm going to take the risk on. Right, oh no. Oh, I may have messed up. Ah, ah, ah. Okay, okay. That worked out surprisingly well. I'm 
I'm not being greedy. Okay. I wish I could zoom out more, then I would know which way to go, but the problem is I just have to take a guess and hope it doesn't lead me to a dead end. I don't know if that's worth it. Oh, there's a lot of Goombas. Okay. I guess it's no guts, no glory, huh? Okay, nice. I'm opening the exit first, now this. Goombas! Oh, shit. Oh, oh, that almost touched me. No! Ah! <laughs> that was one hit in there. Oh, shit, no. Okay, go. I didn't see it. It was under the bridge. Oh no, this is get off get off the floor. Get out of the floor. Get out of the floor. Please, please help. Oh, this is so stressful. Took a wrong turn. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. Holy shit. Oh. Still more ghosts. Oh. Oh. Please, health. I just need to slide this floor and then I get health. Oh my god. Alright, this is the first I've been- I don't know what, what's up next. Mushroom, please. Thank you. I just need another 1,000... 650-ish. Alright, here we go. There's three now. Now I have to run for an even longer distance before I can double back. I'm gonna take what I can out of this floor because I... I opened it up. Oh my god, this is scary. I 
forgot about that. It's okay. This can help. Ooh. Everything's fine. It's <laughs> on the control. The level of micromanagement I have to do here. Shit, that was greedy. But the thing is, I, I kind of have to. Otherwise, I'm never going to get the score. Okay, we're fine. That made up for it. I think I can get it. If I just keep playing like this on these floors and just play well. <sighs> Stay back. Leave the mu mushroom is like, leave it. Leave the mushroom. It's my emergency. Good, good, good. This is why I saved the mushroom. Not good that I got hit. Contingency plan has worked. No! Ah! Oh, no! I got stabbed. Oh, it was a thousand shot. <sighs> I feel like I can do this. I can do this. That doesn't seem like it's that far away. I got too greedy. <laughs> when you get that close, you have to try again. I was gonna stop after that one, but... I mean... I was... But I think two floors and I would have had it. It's okay, the night is still young. I can still do whatever I was gonna do after. No, I can stop anytime I want. I just, I gotta, I gotta spam this. What am I gonna do after? Ask if it was all worth it. Thank <laughs> you. 
walk game. A little bit of Animal Crossing. Just a bit. Otherwise, the villagers will get very passive-aggressive at me that I haven't played in days. Oh wow, we used to have a mayor that used to live here and he looked just like you. It's kind of uncanny how shockingly close you resemble him. I I'd said it again, it's like, if I wish the coin goal was lower, but then you would get to the point that I got up to in half the time, if that makes sense. So, like, maybe a break every five stages, but then, you know, it's harder to get coins. Equal difficulty, just this ramp up at the start. Whoa! <laughs> Oh. I wonder how Australia is doing in, in the football soccer thing. I want to know if I get my day off, but also hope they win. <laughs> I can, I can want both. Oh, ho, ho, okay. I see how it is. All oh, right. Yep. Yeah, this is. Ooh, I can I can deal with this, I can deal with this. Just play it well. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Why is it- I swear it's always platformers that just make me make weird noises. Granted, this isn't a platformer, but because it's Toad, it definitely makes it feel like it. Okay, that was a shroom. you could play this competitively, like... This would be a pretty funny drinking game. <laughs> it's just... The one that, that loses has to drink. Although I guess... It would be a bit of a wind-up, but finish their drink. That's probably the better one. So, like, it escalates very quickly. So it's just, you have to survive, don't... Don't lose. It just gets harder as it progresses. There we go. 
Nice. Open up the whole stage. Okay, they're still, oh, they're still one alive, wow. It survived. got shot. That thing nearly sniped me. I definitely think the ghost part is the hardest. Everything leading up to that is, is not that big a deal. Alright, so Australia lost. <laughs> but they got to go fight for third place. So no public holiday. Damn. I looked quickly. Yeah. I mean, they still did better than the men. <laughs> Either way. I don't think the men's team has ever gotten that far. Playing with fire here. I like the music when it has a little extra layer of detail to it. Good, good stuff. Come out. Get rid of the Goombas. Oh. That's what we call a power play. I felt good to pull off. I can't assume all the Goombas are gone. There's probably still one lurking. No? Good. This is very good. The more I can increase my coin count before I get further on, the better. This, this is fine. I got a lot of coins. Low risk. I'm going to accidentally get most of the coins. If not. Wow, I got all of them. Good floor. Alright, I think it's ghost time. No? Not quite. Oh, that's disgusting. It's like a massive Goomba tower just blocking me. Yep, well, not a whole lot I could do about that one. 
Okay, I'm gonna try and get more coins. This is a risk, but... I feel like I have to. This floor is get off, get off it as quick as possible. Okay, these floors are fine. Find the end of the maze as quick as possible. Lucky, but I'm gonna use this to progress. This just gives me a little more flexibility. Oh, well, this is fresh hell. Please tell me I'm right. I'm right. Okay, good. Okay, one more, one more, one more. Come on. Yes! Oh, alright. <laughs> that's that's it. Now now I'm at the point where it's don't mess up. This is generally fine, provided I just don't... Don't fuck up. Oh, no, no. See, this is way harder. I can't just do that every time. They're gonna turn around and hit me. Okay, I reckon I can get a couple more coins in. being very careful. Just a thousand to go. Well, roughly a thousand. Wanker. Couldn't let me have it. It's okay. I've got the ones that don't feel too risky to get. Like, this entire corridor is pretty safe. Same with this corridor.
getting so close. Oh, these fire flowers, oof. Oh, that's a, that's a very annoying corner I'm going to have to take. Okay, go. Oh, fuck me. There's three of them this time. Fuck! <laughs> Damn it. Ah! That's close, off. Do I do I want do I want to keep being stubborn with this? <laughs> What's the rule? Like, do, do I hundred percent if I get it? Hang on, Captain Toad. <laughs> I want to see what you get. What do you get? Doesn't really say. <sighs> All right. I can't believe I'm getting conned into <laughs> just doing more of this. It's cause it's it's one of those things that like I know I can do, and I just have to try until I keep. Wait, I have to keep trying until I succeed. Jeez, I'm speaking well, aren't I? I just wish that wasn't such a wind-up, that's the problem. I wish I could just jump to the part where the stakes are high. I can't... Should have made some tea. Ah. Uh... I mean, if I do, I'll, I'll stop playing. It's fine. Like, I'm not too fussed by it, but it would be nice to get the, the gold on. Every time I do this, I get closer, so... I've only had a small handful of attempts, it's just each attempt takes a while. So pretty much these things I have to stay away from, and I have to bait them into doing their thing. I think the hardest floor is definitely still the ghost. For that triple charge and chuck room, I have to have health, otherwise I won't be able to do it. I need I need a second player. I need someone here to be stunning things for me. <laughs> Just on, on guard duty. my brother to come over. Yeah, well, he's in Canada right now, so that's not going to be a thing. He watches Twitch and stuff, but he's said admittedly a bunch of times, like, just being live on Twitch just isn't for him. Which, 
Not gonna push yet. What about the younger ones? I mean, they live like a couple hours away. <laughs> hey, drive almost two hours so you can press one button for me for a couple of hours. But also, yeah, they're kind of the same. All right, I'll, I'll do a dating profile, and then I'll be like, must be willing to press a button for me on stream. It's like the only, the only two conditions, must like chicken and must be willing to press a button repeatedly for two hours. Whoa, almost forgot about you. Jeez. I don't think I can take it out, but it's only one. I can manage it. These floors, I'm um, just getting every single coin because later on it's gonna be more difficult to get them all. Was he up? Oh, well, I got it, I got it, I got it. Ah, uh, gold hits. The song is gonna get stuck in my head! <laughs> Shit. The corner. I took the corner poorly. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wasn't trying to do that, <laughs> but okay.
Okay. This floor is interesting. Okay, I got a little break. Please, please tell me this health. I don't want this to just be a, a gold mushroom. Okay, good. Alright, 2000. Pretty good haul. Game starts now. Risk. All right, next. We can take some risks here since there's a shroom. to go past that tower. Sometimes it's just unlucky. Should I have to go to the tower? Okay, nice. Gracefully handled. advantage of this. I'm already almost up to 3,000, which is good. I'm getting everything. Don't care. Ooh, ooh. I almost took a bad corner. Okay. 
Nice, I can do the whole floor. This is a good run. I've been able to do multiple whole floors. Already up to 3,000. Okay, I just have to survive this next part. This survival now. Shit, not good. Oh man. Could have gone for that, but no. Too risky. It would have put me in a bad spot. <laughs> so nerve-wracking. Not shit. Oh, I may have played myself into a corner. I had to take that hit. That was tough. Couldn't see it. Okay. It's fine. Still alive. Honestly, not bad. Already at 3,500. Alright, here we go. I'm just gonna open up the map with this. I mean, I have to take gambles with this, it's... Otherwise, I'm just never gonna get it. Shrimp. Hey, Messiah, how's it going? I can take my time. All the piranha plants are dead. It's 
So, okay. <laughs> Just less than a thousand to go. Very good for business. God, I'm being so greedy here. Shroom. <laughs> Hope I had a good start for week. It's been alright. Couple of busy days, but it was yeah, good. The next floor is, is the big one. Triple charge and charge and chuck. I'm gonna squeeze as much as I can out of this. Without risking my life too much. Avoid. All right, this is the big floor. Here we go. Oh God. You just have to have a shroom at this point, otherwise you won't make it. Right out. Oh my God, it's shy, guys. Turn the corner off. I got further. I was trying to time the shy guy. I'm getting some water. Hold on. think back to like the pun from earlier but like the reason I lost is because there wasn't much room ha <laughs> all right hold on I need to swap my headset batteries
Can you guys hear me now? The fuck happened there? Hold on. Uh, the, the cable got loose. I had to unplug and plug my mic. You can hear now? Okay. The fuck was that? I don't know what happened. I was focusing. But then I did the gamba thing. No, it's like a minute, right? It's okay. Yeah, thanks for checking. <laughs> Check my mic after this. So wait, when I came back from getting water, did I just not say anything? Or did I say something? I don't know, whatever. I said something. Okay. So it hasn't been that long. Okay, I didn't miss out on much, honestly. <sighs> Maybe it was when I put the water bottle down. I must have moved the cable. It might be loose. I plugged it back in and everything seems fine. I had a second player to just harass things on the screen for me, I'd be unstoppable in this mode. play Animal Crossing, but <laughs> this is right. Remember at the start of tonight, I was worried that this was only going to go for an hour? Haha. <laughs> Longest VOD for this series now. Because of this minigame.
Shut up. That's one more thing to worry about, it's okay. <laughs> what? What hit me? Oh, the shadow. On the corner. Do better. I love how I said the first ten floors. They're not a problem. I wonder if the stages are randomly generated or if it's just a set. Ooh, jeez, I almost walked into that. Ugh, that scared the crap out of me. Like, if it's a set number of stages or you can, uh, figure out, like, what's what eventually. Seems pretty random to me, but you never know. It could be like random enough. Just have a lot of stages, and then it just feels random. Oh shit. I didn't see that. Well, that was bad. That's the worst result I've had yet. Did I, no one did the gamble thing, right? <laughs> oh, only one put. Well, it doesn't matter. I don't, I don't think anything's gonna happen with that, also. Alright. We'll probably get it this time. Just watch it happen now. To be honest, I glanced over the other monitor for a sec, and that's what got me killed. Because I, I felt so safe. really doesn't give you many opportunities to look at another screen. I guess at floor 10 I, I take a mental break.
pretty straightforward so far. I kind of realize that it doesn't matter too much if you run. I thought running mattered, but it doesn't, because the toad travels the same speed as you do, so... It's always a set distance, well not set distance, but a set number of steps behind you regardless of how fast you're going. So once you have that in mind, it's, it's not... It's not too bad. It's just when there's multiple of them, that's when it gets stressful. It's like a weird mix of Pac-Man and Snake. It's like, I have to try not to run into the tail, and the tail is the mummy. But then also like Pac-Man where I can get something where I destroy the things that are chasing me. It's cool. Alright, but for real, this will be the last attempt. I, I do want to play Animal Crossing. Maybe as like a... Do I, do I really want to keep playing this game more and just be like, well, I'm going to just try and achieve the goal. Just always have this thing about doing stuff that's repetitive in nature, just... I might be into it. But maybe not! <sighs> maybe not everyone else. <laughs> I stopped for a sec there. I, I... I took my finger off the button for like one second. I can zoom in, but I guess that's kind of not a good idea. Spun around. Wah, wah. <laughs> Should I do it one more time? Why, why am I being so stubborn with this? I, I don't know. Yes. Alright, I'm going to drink some water, and I'm going to stretch. Alright. <laughs> Tenacity. I'm not going to let this turn into five hours. Whoa, that's a pile. Holy crap, this first stage. Okay. 
What, again? It's like the second time that massive pile is in the stage. Already got almost 600 coins from just two floors. Hard mode stages? Hardly. I think it's just random as random. Can maintain a good lead here. This is a good title to have already. Such a little thing to get invested on, but I don't know, it's addictive. Oh, I almost ate it. That was close. Sergeant Chuck just does not give up. What did I get hit by? Oh my god. It's running quicker. Okay, it's fine. It got, ugh, it got hit by the, uh... The Kamek. It, uh, it made things a lot worse because they move quicker without a helmet. Their regard to safety just goes out the window. They should run slower without a helmet, not faster. That's dangerous. Um, I should deal with that before it becomes a problem, huh? Kind of reaching for my cable <laughs> as I'm doing this. Alright, it's plugged in. Skill. If that was the case, everyone in Marika would have a helmet on. Yeah, but in that, it's cosmetic. Here, it's affecting speed.
I'll be fine as long as I can survive the next two stages after this one. Oh, <laughs> These noises. I swear. Got me too. Focusing. <laughs> Very decent, considering that floor ten and already have over two thousand. I'd say this is going really well. If I can keep this up, this is a uh, pretty good attempt. Don't jinx it, I'm stating a fact. That was not great, but it's okay. I really didn't get the most out of that pickaxe. But I guess most of the tower's gone. Yikes. like it was about to catch up to me. Oh, this sucks, I have to get past the tower. Oh, no I don't. Never mind.
Oh no. Oh, that one was dirty. That one was like... I, I couldn't see it. That was in such a blind spot. Ah, oh, balls. Okay, the next floor is like scary. It's the charge and chuck floor. Fuck! I couldn't see it. <sighs> Stupid charge and chuck floor. Good attempt, but no. <sighs> they pincered me. I'm just not gonna say anything. I mean... Yes, I'm having another go. <laughs> I think I've played this this mode for about as much as I've played um the levels today. If not longer now. Is good. It says it's endless, but I, I question that. I guess at a certain point it would probably just start looping the difficulty. I think the aim of this room is just to get the gold mushroom and then the other coins are kind of, well, bonuses if you can get them. It's 
It just depends where you start, honestly. Avoiding the chucks isn't isn't too bad, it's just if you're positioned badly, it sucks. Like I'm not too bad at avoiding them. At a certain point, I just ignore the mummy. De yeah, I definitely know now that it's random because I have yet to see that stage with the massive pile. So I think that's just in the rotation. I had it within the first 10 stages last time, so random is random. This was uh, a weird flaw. Okay. Yeah, I mean, look at the difference. Not even 2,000 this time. At least that one had the pile. I'll be able to get almost all. 
relatively safely. Just those last three that, eh, it's probably not worth. Okay, last six. Oh, that's probably not worth skipping this floor. I had no choice. I was in a bad spot very quickly. Ooh. Okay. This corn is going to suck. I have to bait them. This is, this is the important stage. Okay, I got lucky this time. I got the 50. Oh. Wow, that was dumb. I, I, yeah. <laughs> I think that shows that I should probably stop playing this. That was such a horrible mistake. That mistake should not have been made. Could have been worse. <laughs> the worst being death. At least I survived. out of this floor. Room's too risky. They have more to lose. That 
That is, wow, that is a layout. Fantastic layout. Low risk. Very good. These floors have been surprisingly excellent. Wow. <laughs> okay. All right, the important one. Here we go. Yes! Good. Got the gold shroom and survived. Alright. I believe... Oh, this is cursed. Oh my god, this is cursed. I'm fucked. Oh, that was horrible. They put so many Shy Guys back to back. I don't know how I was supposed to get through that, really. I should have just tried to run through. Alright, I had enough attempts of it. <laughs> if I'm feeling like I want to do more, maybe we'll do one more stream of it, but I think I need I need to step away from it for now. Plus, it's been, I don't know, like, uh, whatever, four hours? The VOD needs to end. But I do hope you enjoyed this so far. Um, yeah. Let me know if you want to see more of this if you're watching later on YouTube. And, uh, I'll, I'll consider it myself anyway. I'm sure, like, uh, stubbornness may prevail here. Anyway, thanks for uh, sticking around to the end if you're watching later on YouTube. And if you did enjoy the video, remember, if you want to support the channel, the easiest way is just do the button clicking for the algorithm stuff. Or maybe you want to watch me play something else. I'm sure two other videos have appeared on your screen. Till next time, bye YouTube.